my name is Jarl Holbert. I'm director here at Artist Music. Today, Duke the Piano Dana is going to review the Yamaha U1. He's in the academy in a practice room right now working on his part for his big performance. Let's go get him. The Yamaha U1 48-inch Professional Upright is among Yamaha's best-selling upright pianos. If you are in the market for a pre-owned Yamaha piano, we recommend checking the piano serial number on Yamaha's website to confirm that it was built for the U.S. market. Yamaha pianos sold in the U.S. that are not built for the U.S. market, also known as gray market pianos, are not eligible for parts or other support from the Yamaha Corporation. As can be seen, the piano being reviewed today was built for the U.S. market. If still available at Artist Music, the purchaser will receive a lifetime limited warranty and a discount when mentioning this video. Hey Duke, you ready to help with the review? We need to review the Yamaha U1. Since Duke's opinion of Yamaha hasn't changed since his first video, we're going to conceal the piano's brand name and tell him that we don't know what the piano is. Duke, you ready to help me with the review? Um, I don't know what the piano is, but let's go see. Ready? Let's go. Duke starts with an inspection of the front of the piano. He then walks around the piano, checking the piano visually and using his keen sense of smell to take in the quality of the materials. The soundboard and back posts are vital to the piano's sound and structure. Duke checks them carefully. Next, he checks the responsiveness of the pedals. Duke checks the touch and tone of the low, middle, and high registers of the piano. After completing the inspection, Duke is presented with a score sheet. We're hiding the piano brand from him, so we use question marks in place of the piano's name. The humans at Artist Music disagree with Duke on this one. We gave the Yamaha U1 three and a half stars, with some points lost because of the U1's overly bright sound, the flimsy music rack, which is not great for holding music, and because of Yamaha's use of a plastic jack in its action, which is inferior to the carbon fiber used in Kawai's action. Still, the U1 is a decent piano, as you can hear from this demonstration. 